hello everybody and welcome back to another brand new video and in today's video we're gonna be going over the fps optimization tool which is known as hone optimizer so you can basically use this optimizer to boost your fps in minecraft and uh, it's actually pretty simple i'm gonna be walking you through how uh, to do it and do it exactly so it's pretty simple just head over to the description and open the link that i gave you guys so this is that link that i was talking about so all you have to do here is click on download hone and then once you click on it you will basically see this screen right here just click save and you're done uh, the next thing i want you to I want you guys to do is download feather client or uh, you could download feather client or you could also download uh, luna client both of them are good i recommend downloading either one of them Okay, so once you've downloaded Feather Client, I want you guys to open the mod section and right here I want you guys to download Sodium, Lithium, Ferrite Core and Entity Culling along with Concurrent Chunk Management because these mods are designed to boost your FPS. The other mods that I've used are for the quality of life so you don't need to worry about that. Okay, so you can go ahead and launch your game and after that head over to home optimizations and here i want you guys to apply all the five optimizations that you see here unless you specifically don't want to for example this uh, optimization right here disables xbox because when these type of applications are running in a background they often tend to slow down your pc so to avoid that um this, soft, this software recommends you to disable xbox because we are not using it as much because we are on pc obviously so uh, yeah so this this is something that you can do and again unless you don't want to so i'm just gonna click optim uh, apply all five optimizations here okay, so you are going to head over to the games tab and here you're gonna see minecraft so all you have to do is just click it and go to light mode and activate all the presets that you see there because that is going to boost your fps and i also recommend you guys to try out the premium version of this because it offers a wider range of optimizations so yeah the light and here i want you guys to go to video settings and here i want you guys to copy the exact same thing now here uh, the render distance can be anything between 8 to 12 or let's say 6 to 12 because this highly depends on your pc if it can handle the chunks loading or not uh, we'll keep it around 8 to 12 so yeah you, you guys can base it off of your pc and then after that i don't really recommend turning on vsync but if your fps is too bad i think you should I think I believe that you should turn on vSync because that will sync your FPS with your monitor's refresh hertz refresh rate, which could increase FPS but will cause a little bit of input lag, mostly unnoticeable though. And then after that, just copy all these settings and then even the performance. And here's the real trick. So if you want to get more FPS, just uh, just slide this bar to around two to four. So because that will <coughs> increase your fps um, drops and and after you apply all those optimizations you are pretty much done so yeah that's it for today's video if your fps has improved i would love to see your comments and um, yeah thank you so much for watching today's video guys i'm really happy that you guys watched it till the end so meet you guys in the next video take care and bye, -bye.